Being overweight is one of the absolute worst things you can do to your body and your mind. Not only will it damage your joints, increase your risk of illnesses like heart disease and diabetes, but it will also mess up your hormonal balance. In particular, it will severely decrease your testosterone levels, along with increasing your estrogen levels. This happens because the process that converts testosterone to estrogen takes place in the body's fat cells. This imbalance between testosterone and estrogen will only make matters worse, contributing to further weight gain and even loss of muscle mass. But far worse is the effect it will have on your mental health. Not only will being overweight reduce your confidence just due to the fact that you are less attractive, but since testosterone plays a crucial role in men's mental health, low testosterone levels will dramatically increase your risk of depression, anxiety, and low self-esteem. You need to act now. Bringing down your body fat levels and increasing muscle mass is crucial to your overall well-being and your ability to succeed in every aspect of life. In this video, I will share with you the single most effective way of reducing body fat. But be warned, this is not going to be easy and you should prepare yourself for a long, painful journey. But trust me, it will all be worth it in the end. Let's get started. Number one, lift and lift heavy. A lot of people, when they want to lose body fat, they instantly assume that they need to hit the treadmill and go for long, low-paced jogs to burn off calories. While this is true and you will burn calories from doing this, there is a far better solution, which is lifting heavy weights. The problem with low-intensity cardio is that even though you are burning calories, the moment you stop running, you also stop burning calories. But that is not the case when lifting heavy weights. This is due to something called the afterburn effect. What it means is that after an intense workout with heavy weights, your body will continue to be in a state of increased metabolism, increasing the amount of calories your body burns even while you sleep. This effect will last as long as 24 hours after a heavy workout. But not only this, as opposed to running on a treadmill, heavy lifting will also increase your muscle mass. And the more muscle mass you have, the more calories your body will burn just to sustain itself. It is indeed a win-win situation, but there is more. Lifting, particularly heavy lifting, will also increase your testosterone levels by itself. And the higher your testosterone levels, the more calories you burn. In short, by lifting heavy, you will transform the way your body consumes calories 24 hours a day. You should focus mainly on big compound movements like squats, deadlifts, bench presses, pull-ups, dips, bent over rows and overhead presses, and keep the amount of repetitions between four and eight. With that said, if you experience injuries or joint pain, you may want to reduce the weight and increase the amount of repetitions, and always make sure to warm up properly. Number two, eat more meat. This one is absolutely crucial. Eating more meat, along with eating less carbohydrates, will help you in numerous ways. Firstly, it will increase your protein intake, helping you preserve your hard-earned muscle mass while you are in a caloric deficit. But it will also make it easier to maintain that caloric deficit, since it is nearly impossible to overeat if you eat mostly meat. Furthermore, it will increase the amount of fat you consume, which will be used as the primary source of fuel instead of carbohydrates. This is good for two things. The first is that when you reduce your carbohydrate intake, you also reduce your insulin levels. Insulin is what makes your body take all the calories in, and when you have too many insulin spikes, it will lead to fat gain. Secondly, with increased fat intake, you also increase your cholesterol levels, and cholesterol is actually the precursor to the most important hormone we have, testosterone. So by increasing your fat intake, you will automatically increase your testosterone levels, thus also increasing your body's basal metabolic rate. Now I am not saying that you should go on an all-meat diet and completely eliminate carbohydrates. Research actually shows that consuming too small amounts of carbohydrates actually decreases testosterone levels. So find a good middle ground, but try to only consume the good carbohydrates and avoid refined sugar, which is terrible for both insulin and testosterone levels. Number three, sprint, sprint, sprint. This one, the absolute pinnacle of exercise. When it comes to shedding body fat, increasing testosterone levels, and building explosive power, nothing can compare to sprinting. You can also call this high-intensity interval training. In terms of shedding body fat, 
Sprinting have both the benefits of steady state cardio and the benefits of heavy lifting. While the calories burned during heavy lifting is mostly due to the afterburn effect, sprinting also burns an immense amount of calories during the act itself. But sprinting also causes the afterburn effect so you will literally become a monster in terms of calorie expenditure. Now I know a lot of people, especially if you are overweight, will not be able to sprint at full capacity due to joint pain, particularly in the knees. But sprinting doesn't have to be running. You can also sprint on a bicycle, or you can sprint while swimming. Both of these activities will be much easier on your joints. And then, when you have shed some weight, you might be able to give it a try on the running track. Number four, be consistent. This is obviously the most important one. Once you start following these tips, you will quickly come to realize how hard it can be. Sprinting in particular is not comfortable at all. You will feel your heart pumping out of your chest and your lungs will be screaming. You will get a metallic taste of blood in your mouth. You will want to stop, but you must be consistent. You must keep doing it, otherwise it will all be in vain. You got this, brother. We are all in this together, and you know what they say. Tough times create strong men. So put yourself through these tough sessions, build your discipline, and witness for yourself how you transform from an overweight weakling into a strong, powerful, masculine man that carries himself with pride. Lastly, there is a few honorable mentions that I didn't think deserved a number on the list by themselves, but they are still worth mentioning. 1. Take cold showers. This increases your testosterone levels and is also good for your blood flow and your immune system. 2. Get enough sleep and good quality sleep. Sleep in complete darkness and complete silence. Minimize screen light at least one hour before bed and sleep in a cool room. And sleep naked. 3. Take vitamins. Making sure your body gets all the vitamins and minerals it needs is essential for every aspect of your health, including your weight. That's it for today's video, gentlemen. You are now equipped with the knowledge you need to go out and transform your body and therefore also transform your mind. But watching this video is not enough. I know that a lot of you watching this will watch this video, get motivated for five minutes and then continue watching other videos. But this knowledge is absolutely worthless if you don't take action. Not tomorrow, not next week. Today, I am rooting for you, for all of you. I have nothing but love for my fellow men, and I wish to see all of us succeed in life. But in the end, it will ultimately be up to you to make the change. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, since it really helps out the YouTube algorithm, thus helping me reach out to more people. Thank you so much for watching guys. Now go, go and conquer.